Hey there guys, Jacob here with Mystery Arts Inc. And thank you again for tuning in. Welcome to our home for everything that is magic, mentalism, and the mystery arts. Whether it's hypnotism or fire eating, it's weird, it's wonderful, and we value it here. So if you're somebody interested in those kind of things and excelling in the mystery arts, I would highly suggest you go down and hit that subscribe button. Ding dong, ditch the bell if you want to be updated with all of our new content coming out, special offers, you name it. And finally, of course, do give us a like if you do find value in this video. It does help us grow the channel and tells YouTube that you are releasing precious, precious dopamine into your brain, which is in turn making you a happy camper. So that being said, today we're going to go into Heartbeat by Juan Carlos. This effect is taking the internet by storm. Illusionist, again, hitting what I what G refers to as a slam banger. If you haven't seen an interview with Jeryan Clark from Illusionist, check that out. It should appear right here uh, during the video. Just go ahead and click that if you haven't seen that yet. Some fascinating stuff in there. But in a round, full circle way of what we're going to discuss in this video as an overview before we begin, we're going to cover what the effect is and the history as I know it, uh, addressing some of the controversy that's been surrounding it, what's in the box in the instructional video, you know, is this thing, and that's another controversy point on it, is this worthwhile as a physical product? A spoiler, I say yes. What am I using it for? How am I combining it with things like Bill Montana's Pulse, Jerome Finley's Heart Song, the Jumping Pulse by Bill Cushman, The Bridge, and how am I even using it to get into telepathy and action style, as apparently pseudo uh, mind control hypnosis, so telepathic hypnosis looking stuff. How am I using it to get into that? And finally, we'll kind of wrap everything up at the bottom with a conclusion. Who is it for? Is it valuable? Do you need this thing so bad that it absolutely should keep you up at night? And a uh, spoiler alert for that too, I believe that is the case. So if those of you watching this too, there will be an opportunity to have 10% off at Illusionist, not just for Heartbeat, but your entire order. As a comf as somebody that's kind of involved with Illusionist, we're able to get this kind of discount for you. So please do use it, and I think you'll find a lot of value here. That being said, let's go ahead and roll that intro and get right into it. All right, guys, so Heartbeat by Juan Carlos. This thing is crazy good to start off here, just to cut away the fat. The effect is this. You have your spectator place their hand, their right hand on their heart. You have them put their index finger out just like so. You introduce a pencil or other device similar. You touch it to their finger. When you put your hand on your heart, they feel your heartbeat come through your whole circuit of your body down through the pencil into them they feel your heartbeat it's an incredible effect i've never heard of anything really like it in a lot of ways it's very unique and i've done a lot of pulse related effects over the years i love like i said the top of this bill montana's pulse jerome finley's heart song uh, the jumping pulse bridge has an element of that to it this is i've used pulse related effects to get in telepathy in action so this is really really good for me for how i handle telepathy in action which is very jerome finley-esque but i kind of discovered on my own when i was a teenager doing just nothing but hypnosis and this thing does that really well which we'll cover later that being said before we get into this really let me first say a quick disclaimer so i love illusionist you'll see me in some of their products i i you know they're my buddies and i want to be clear here that this effect I, I did get actually two of them, right? So one of them I spent my own money on, and I ordered and I got. And then because I'm a one of the top people in the affiliate program, which for those of you watching, if you use the link down below or coupon code Jacob Michaels, you see here, you will get 10% not just off heartbeat, but your entire order at Illusionist. It's my gift to you. I do get a small kickback. But in the grand scheme of things, it just kind of goes to keep this channel going and make it worthwhile. So that being said, Heartbeat is incredible. And I'm so happy to have one to open for myself. You can see I've actually removed the sticker off of that. It's on top of my laptop because it's so cool. And this one has the sticker on it right here. And uh, this is my collecting one <clears throat> that I will be basically putting on the shelf and it will remain unopened. You know, they sent me that for free for being a higher end affiliate. And uh, I didn't know about that till after I'd ordered my main one, but I kept both of them because, you know, I just love the effect. I'm happy to have two, essentially, right? So that being said, the effect, again, is they feel your heartbeat come through a pencil or a cigarette 
You can do it just with your finger as well, but it's not quite as cool, honestly. That I, and, and Juan kind of goes into this in the download, and I agree with him in a lot of ways. It's a much more interesting picture with the pencil, right? What's in the instructional contents that makes so valuable? The instructional is not super long. So for those of you that were kind of the detractors when uh, Thought of Card to Pocket came out, which I think is another great effect. If you haven't seen the review for that, you could find that here on the channel. It's a great, great piece. Um, but for those of you that thought it was just too much in that download and that it could have been kind of condensed and a little more concise, this one is very, very concise. Running it about, I think, in the ballpark of 30 or 40 minutes, you're gonna have Juan basically run through, do a couple live performances where you see people just absolutely melt like we've seen with Chris Ramsey in his video, like we've seen on social media with the various you know clips that have come out of Heartbeat being done on magicians, on normal people. Uh, there's a special appearance in here by actually the guy that designed the packaging for this, which I think that I love the packaging again. Always spoils illusionist packaging. And uh, Oban Jones, who makes the decks and the packaging, the designs, and illusions. And he's not a magician, but he's a very educated muggle. And trust me when I say, the reaction that he gives in the actual download is a true one. And I've never seen him light up like that before. It would not surprise me at all if he actually learned this effect. It would not surprise me at all. I mean, Oban's not the type of guy to go for that. Uh, Oban Jones, great dude. Go follow him on Instagram. Mind blowing guy. Yeah, it's 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 just it's just insane of an effect, isn't it? We've all kind of always wanted these things to deeply connect with our audiences and have them feel something truly extraordinary. And you think this would be just a one-on-one -on -one effect, but because of the level of reaction you get from just doing it to one person, this actually kind of waves out and people go, whoa, what's going on? And other people observing it see the huge state change that happens in the person. And because of that, it really looks magical from looking in as well, even though it would traditionally be what's seen as like a one-on-one -on -one style effect. That being said, let's crack open uh, one of these packages here and have a look at the contents and go into what's in the box. Okay, so as you can see here, I actually have two of these. Uh, one's, this is gonna be my collector's one, and the only difference between this one and this one, this is that this one remains unopened. It still has this heartbeat sticker on it. I'm gonna keep this as a collector's item because I do think this is gonna be an effect that goes down as something really, really memorable, important. So we'll get that guy out of the way, that being said, and look at the one that we do have currently opened. Now, first off, the sleeve looks lovely. I'm gonna try my best not to show that back there that has the secret instructions on it. Um, there's been a lot of debate on this because it doesn't really need to be a physical product. You know, you can see in the tin here, which I do think it's cute and nice, they have this, this kind of pencil tin for it. You have this nice sleeve, you get the perfect pencil for the actual effect. And uh, this is it, this is the perfect pencil, you just have to sharpen it and that's it. Uh, you get a file here, which again, if you know the effect, you, you'll know why it's important. And you get some special dry hands powder with that same heartbeat sticker on it um, this looking like uh, something that you find sometimes in some fine dining if i can get it open here there we go it's looking kind of conspicuous be careful traveling with this folks if you do take this on the road with you luckily my hands and my skin are perfect for this effect so i don't really need this stuff as much but it does look suspect so be careful taking this on an airplane that being said that's what's inside the box that's really it and this leads to an interesting quandary here. And that quandary really is, do we really need this to be a physical effect? A physical release, a physical product? Why is it not just a download? And the truth of the matter is, it could be. But it's not, is, in my opinion, as premium of an experience like it deserves in that form. And on the interview I did with uh, G over at Illusionist, if you haven't seen that, that'll pop up right above here on a little card. Check that out. Save that for after this. It's a great video to watch. We'll actually link it here at the end of the video too. But in in that video, we kind of go over that. This is a, an experience for your spectators. It's not really a magic trick. It's not really a mentalism trick. It's something completely different. And the same thing goes with the packaging and everything, right? That and Illusion is trying to really get around some of the problems having Murphy's and make physical products with beautiful packaging so they can sell these to brick and mortar magic shops and cut deals with them to help keep those brick and mortars alive, which I think is fantastic. I love that. I absolutely love that. So 
All that being said, I think totally this is justified being a physical product, in my opinion. To get the perfect pencil, the one Juan uses, everything you need, dry hands powder in case you've got problems with your skin, I think it's a, it's a no-brainer, right? And the effect itself, I think is worth the $30, $35, whatever it ends up being at the final price-wise that this is, right? I mean, I love it so much that I could have just given away, because I've gotten extra ones before, I've got an extra one of uh, any thought of card to pocket as well, and I could have just sent that away to somebody I'm keeping as a keepsake. Same thing with this. This, this other one that is the unopened, kind of, for my collection one, will remain unopened and loved on my shelf forever. And I'm just super excited to actually have both of it. So that being said, I think this is going to be something that's going to be a, an effect that you're going to want to be able to have the physical product for. You're going to love the packaging. It's going to help you keep organized. And you're going to have everything you need to perfectly do it without any kind of excuses out the gate. So do I think this deserves to be a physical product? Absolutely. So what about the instructional download? Let's go a little more depth than that. It's really cut and dry. Uh, Juan's really created something here that you don't need to really change anything. I changed one small element of the presentation, but everything else I do is exactly as done in the download by Juan. Because it really is perfect. The He goes over the use of indirection to really clarify and showcase the effect. He goes into you know the mechanics of it. What do you need to know? Extreme close-ups to really see the, what's going on here and the fu special functionality and history of it as well. There is quite a bit of history in here about what this is. Chances are that if you're watching this, you might have actually seen this before in another form. And that's what's so fascinating. I know for a fact I've seen this in another form and it still fooled me, which kind of goes to show you the power of this effect. Case in point, if you can take a card trick and switch it over to business cards, you can typically fool a magician with it. You can debate that all you want to, but I've seen it a million times. We've switched up the premise. By switching up the premise, it fools everybody outright and creates a really amazing little experience for your spectators. Now, all that being said, the video download is short, sweet, to the point. You know, you see reactions by, again, by Oban Jones in there, and he's completely losing his stuff. You see the performance of the on the street with this the one gentleman with the beard that you'll see in the video. Uh, I was really pleased with the quality, as always, by Illusionist. So that being said, let's go into what I'm actually doing with this, because I've been performance for a few weeks since before I got the physical product. What I did is I happened to go out with my little sister looking, actually rug shopping at this little dollar store kind of setup in kind of the questionable part of town, and I found these. And these pencils are absolutely perfect for the effect. So I've got a couple pre-made in here. Um, you know, this style of pencil, I really like these. The brand is Basic, B-A-Z-I-C products. Uh, the recycled paper uh, pencils. Yeah, it says crayon. I don't know if it's a translation in another language. But these work great. I've been using these to do the effect for the past few weeks, and it's been absolutely stellar. And this fits so nicely because we all want to have an excuse to carry a pencil anyway don't we if you're doing nail writer like scribe or something like that then you definitely want to basically have a pencil on you so you don't have to you know because i'm not gonna lie that compared to the pencil version of a nail writer the the ink style ones and the listo led style ones are not in my opinion quite as good and reliable as that nice quality pencil lead. It just looks nicer. So now you have an excuse to carry a pencil and do things along those lines, which is kind of cool in my opinion. I think that's a plus in my eyes. And this has now become part of my EDC for sure. That one of these goes in my pocket everywhere I go. I'm really, really happy about this. So how I've been using it is essentially this. I talk about, you know, human connection and human condition. And I tell them like, if you ever, you know, you ever, um, as a kid, have like a battery, like a D-cell battery, you have a couple wires attached, you attach one to a little tiny light bulb, and when you touch the bottom contact, the light bulb, bing, and it comes on. It's because it completes the circuit, right? And, and the light comes on. It's, it's really cool. What's interesting is this, there's this old theory by Franz Mesmer, who's actually the guy that's like the OG, you know, hypnotist. He called it animal magnetism. This idea that there's this channeling, you know, ooze of magnetic fluid that runs through humanity. And when you manipulate that, we can do amazing things. Well, I don't think that is really uh, a truism. What I've done is I've kind of, I've played around with some of the ideas of it and I kind of found this out and I can't really explain how this works, it just does. But that being said, can I show you something really amazing? That once you experience it, you'll there's no going back you're gonna remember this for the rest of your life. 
and it's something true and honest. And I really build it up in all of the right ways. And I say, perfect. Well, first off, follow me. Can you just put your hand up like this? And they follow suit. And like I said, just can you just follow me and put your hand on your heart? They do that. Can you just put your index finger out like this? Perfect. I go over, adjust it nicely. And then I do the exact same way Juan does it from there. This is, there's a, there's a rule kind of in marketing, not really a rule, but a suggestion, a big suggestion. If it ain't broke and it's working, there's no need to fix it, but refining it is okay. And I've just kind of, I don't even think, I think this thing is kind of finely as refined as it needs to be. This is a truly exceptional piece where you don't need the talking about the battery and the light. I just use it to kind of reel people in a little bit more because I'm not quite as enigmatic as a character, I think, as Juan is. You have to kind of take this and make it work with your own personality because if you can't command attention out the gate using traditional means, you got to kind of lean on your strengths, don't you? And that's kind of what I've done here with how I present it. Now, what's cool is you're kind of at a state here after you perform this, you get a massive reaction, you kind of gauge it. You can gauge the situation. Do they want to see more? Or is it good enough just to stop right there? And it takes a lot of responsibility and a lot of um, self-awareness to really, I think, figure that out. So for those of you out there that are trying to do three effects every time, just feel socially after you do one, is that enough? Because if it is enough, doing three will not really help it, in my opinion, right? I've been testing this though, and I do feel that there's more, there's more to be done. I can then go in and actually move into something like the Pulse by Bill Montana. For those of you who don't know the Pulse, they take their Pulse here, they take your Pulse here, they feel that they're different, and then what they do is they feel the pulses actually sync up after a small kind of connection ritual, which is really, really cool effect. And from my understanding, if you actually hooked them up to an EKG, your pulses would really be synced. Like it's that level of just like cool. And it works on its own. It's very, very cool. For those of you that don't have Pulse by Bill Montana, I do highly suggest you check that out. Purchase direct from Bill if you can. I don't know where that would be, but don't buy it from the Dirty Bird. Uh, because don't give the dirty bird money. This also goes really well and lends into something like the jumping pulse as well, where you can then have them hold their hand up and then they, and every, or everybody holds their hand up and they feel the pulse jump across their fingers because it's such a larger, beautiful convincer that anything you say after that, you can just wave your hands and go, look, rainbows. And they go, oh my God, wow. You know, it's a really, this effect is so cool because it draws their attention in, inward so much and focuses their feeling. Uh, you know, on that point, and you get a yes set out of it too, saying, you know, can you follow along? You'll notice I, I do the can you, can you, can you, I get them to follow along. You get really good social compliance with this. It can really lead into a genuine trance state after that. So typically what I could do is I could even say that now, you know, we're on the same wavelength. Let's try and take this a little further. You know, I'm going to um, put my fingers like this. You do the same. I'm going to put a gap and watch as I close my fingers, what yours want to do. And then in synchronicity, y'all do that and you go, great. Now, as I'm holding my fingertips very tightly here and I hold them together, notice what happens when you try and separate yours and find that you find out what happens and they go and they can't separate their fingertips and you can push it further. Another one I do all the time is I'm gonna put my hand back on my chest here and notice I hold my hand tightly to my chest. Notice what happens when you try and pull yours off as I hold mine tightly. What happens is they typically feel they can't, they grab at the wrist right here. I say that's stuck too, and then they're in this whole thing, right? It's kind of telepathy in action by Orville Meyer in a lot of way, creating that illusion of like hypnotic trance where you're not directly giving commands, things are just happening and you're synced, you know, things along those lines. You can use this as well, you know, if you want to, to sync other people. I've done this for years. It sounds like a pipe dream to some of you watching this. I know there's a lot of magicians out there just out and out hate hypnosis, but you can use this as a great way to lead into that. It's super valuable on that front. And, uh, you know, even on its own though, without using hypno or anything, fuck, this is a good effect. This is so good. You know, leading us right into our wrapping up conclusion here. Who is this for? This is for magicians, mentalists, mystery artists, uh, hypnotists even, that want to create a genuine experience. Like, look, man, if you're the fast speaking, I'm a hustler card shark guy, maybe, maybe think twice about this one. Or maybe have this in your pocket and give it a little more, uh, a different kind of vibe to your other things you do. 
I don't think that a party clown kind of magician or, uh, you know, Johnny, Johnny Ace is, you know, the fast talking uh, magic guy that goes a million miles per hour, I don't think you're going to be able to do this quite as well. It's not going to have the same impact as it would for somebody that's kind of like me in a way where I just let everything breathe. I'm a huge believer in not making me special, not making you special, making the moment special. That's kind of really my core philosophy. How can we make magic moments, not magic you, not magic me? And that's really, I think, who this is for. If you want to have genuine moments, they're going to emotionally connect you with an audience in an almost hypnotic way that even if they hated your guts before, if you can at least get them to commit down to this and experience it, you're probably going to win their heart. This is an effect for you. This is really great. You don't use this all the time. Like, it's part of my EDC, but it's not my go-to. You know, if I feel really connected with somebody and they're really the right person, I can open with this. But typically, I'm opening with something more along the lines of coins, maybe mentalism and palm reading, uh, whatever I can feel the vibe of the moment is. Is how serious is it? This is definitely, in my opinion, on the grounds for the effect of the year. And I've already helped and worked with some pretty exceptional stuff uh, going in, starting this year off, and seeing some incredible things. But this. This effect, this heartbeat, takes the fucking cake, guys. Like, I don't know any other way to say it. Like, I can't, I'm just being sincere with you. If you think 30 or $35 is too much for something that's not, that transcends a magic, that transcends the traditional magic in people's eyes and goes into something that feels like a magical moment experience, a real ability, uh, you, it's, it's probably not for you. And, man, you really might want to rethink kind of how you go about magic Unless that's exclusive of your character. Like, I'm not trying to invalidate you by saying that. I'm just letting you know who this is really for. And I hope that all of you out there that get this, take it out, use it really in reserve for special moments, and it closes you a lot of deals, wins a lot of hearts for you, helps you achieve your goals like it's been helping me. Because, God, I love performing this thing. It's so hard to be responsible and not use this thing every single time I perform. And I'm being honest when I say that. I hope you can feel that sincerity coming from me to you, and it really is that great. So if you're somebody out there that wants, that really wants to have something that's a, a heart piece, a connection piece, a unforgettable moment, that's gonna basically connect you with another person and you treat them with respect and love, this effect is for you. This effect is totally for you. You're the person this effect was, that Juan puts this effect out for. So, that being said, I've been highly impressed with it. I really highly recommend it. And if you haven't picked it up already, again, you can use the coupon code down below, Jacob Michaels, or just use the link here in the description. And, you know, you won't just get 10% off your entire, your, uh, off of Heartbeat, you'll get 10% off your entire order over at Illusionist. And, you know, I get a small kickback again, but you know, this is one of the values I can add to my subscription base here. That being said, if you got some value in this video, if you have any questions, concerns, just comment them down below. Please, if you got something of value or this kind of opened your eyes in some way or something resonated with you, uh, go ahead and hit the like button. Let me know that you actually like this. It does help actually genuinely make the channel bigger. And of course, subscribe is highly suggested if you're looking to really excel and advance in the world of magic, mentals, and mystery arts. We're going to have a lot of special guests on here. There's a lot of exciting stuff in the works outside just doing these review videos, and that's coming soon. And then, you know, of course, thank you again for tuning in. So if you're watching this, I do highly suggest you pick up Heartbeat by Juan Carlos. Uh, buy two, because I promise it's going to be a collector's item someday, and I know I'm going to be glad to have mine in 20 years when I'm like, oh, I remember when that came out. I've got an OG original one. So that's all I got for you this time. Um, Jacob again, signing out, and I'll see you on the next one. Catch you on the double lift side. Cheers.